Hi, my name is Derry Franz, and we are going today to solve the exponential equations. Okay, this is our first equation, and we have to solve it for x if possible. So we have 4 powered by 2x plus 1 equals 8 powered by 1 minus x. We will use the rule that if we have the same base in both sides of equation a, then we can equate the exponents. In this case, x equals k. So in our case, we have just to make our base to be the same. I think let it be 2. 4 is 2 squared. So our left hand side of our equation will be 2 squared powered by 2x plus 1 equals and our right hand side will be 2 powered by 3 and then powered by 1 minus x. We can rewrite it like 2 powered by 2 multiplied by 2x plus 1 equals 2 powered by 3 multiplied by 1 minus x. And now we can use our law, our rule. We have the same base, both sides of equation, and we can write that our exponents are equal 4x plus 1 equals 3 minus 3x. It's easy now to solve it for x. 7x equals 1 or it means that x equals 1 divided by 7. This is our answer. Okay, next equation is 9 powered by 2 minus x equals 1 divided by 3 powered by 2x plus 1. So I think the base we have to get in both hand sides is 3. 9 is 3 powered by 2 and 1 divided by 3 is 3 powered by minus 1. So we can rewrite our equation. 3 powered by 2 powered by 2 minus x equals 3 powered by minus 1 powered by 2x plus 1. Okay, let us multiply our powers. We get 3 powered by 2 multiplied by 2 minus x uh, equals 3 powered by minus 1 multiplied by 2x plus 1. So we have the same base in both sides of equation, so we can use our rule and equate the exponents. And we have that 4 minus 2x equals minus 2x minus 1, which means that 5 equals 0. Uh oh, I think this equation has no solution. Okay, let's see the next. 2 powered by x multiplied by 8 powered by 1 minus x equals 1 divided by 4. So the base I would like to have in both sides will be 2. Let us rewrite 8 like 2 powered by 3 and 1 divided by 4 like 2 powered by minus 2 we will get 2x multiplied by 2 powered by 3 powered by 1 minus x equals 2 powered by minus 2. Let us rewrite it like 2 powered by x plus 3 minus 3x. I multiply it here 3 by 1 minus x and get 3 minus 3x and equals 2 powered by minus 2. So after using our rule we will get that our exponents are equal, so it means that 3 minus 2x equals minus 2, or, or 2x equals 5, or it means that x equals 2 and a half. That's it. This is our answer. So we got 2 solutions and there is no solution for the second equation. Thank you very much for staying with me and hope to see you soon. Bye!